Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. This is Sunday, March the 8th, and it is 5.48 p.m. I want to share with you two videos that I have been sent in my email and watched. This one, I don't know if you watch them already or not, is uh, Saving Lives, LLC. One of his messages was actually in Dawn's email, and I started to share it from there, but then I thought, well, a lot of them probably already watch Cameron on his channel, but you may not know of him, so I'm going to share this. Now, I watch him regularly. I don't get to catch every single one, but usually Tessa sends them to me, and I, I, I watch them. I can usually tell by the by the title uh, that it's that it's his. I don't know why, but I do. Well, anyway, this one. Oops, back it up. Okay, this one's called Rapture. Powerful word from Jesus once and for all, 2020. Okay. Um, well, all I can tell you is you need to see it. It's just very, very encouraging that the Lord is coming any day now. And he's telling mockers and scoffers. Let's see how he worded it. Here, here. It's right here. Whoops. I went back too far. Your mocking ends now, he says. Because... He starts off, he always shows like a little uh, scripture and maybe some preaching from a preacher. Uh, sometimes he uses John Hagee, who I, I wouldn't watch anymore, but he picks out a snippet of, of a sermon that's pertinent to the message. Okay, so anyway... Um, he has grown very popular, and he's a very young man. I think he's like 17 or 18 years old, and it's just amazing. But so anyway, it's called uh, Rapture, Powerful Word from Jesus, Once and for All, 2020, and his channel is Saving Lives, LLC. I'll put the link and all of that in the description box which I know some of you can't read, so you have to write it down and look it up, okay? All right, now the other one, uh, let me pull it up in my history. Okay, it, it's a short uh, clip. Uh, uh, it's a short video. This is Dabu 7. From Dabu 7, who's showing... A huge, this is the name of the video, huge wheel-like, that's hyphenated, wheel-like, it's W-H-E-E-L, something like a wheel, object caught creeping by in space. And it's a two-minute, 43-second video, and he shows it. Uh, it's outer space. It's not black. It's gray. Uh, I guess when you enlarge, however, it turns it gray, but I don't know about all that. But it shows this huge... I mean, it has to be huge. If all these little dots on here are stars out in outer space, uh, it's, it's a complete a, a perfect circle, and inside the circle is something that looks like, a, he, he calls it a cross, but there's an object that looks like a wheel turning within a wheel turning, okay? But, but the outer wheel, I really can't see turning. I mean, he's, um, when my sister Trisha sent it to me, she called it a is this Ezekiel's wheel? You know, when Ezekiel uh, 
saw a wheel within a wheel. Okay. Anyway, you take a look at it, see what you think. And here's the thing about it. The thing gets about, it's on the space, I don't know what, what he called it, one of their cameras for about three, four, five seconds, and then sh they cut it. Someone caught caught it, because I'm sure they're not watching it every second, but someone caught it and cut it. So you couldn't see it anymore. So that gives me pause to think it's important. They don't want you to see it. Okay, so I'll leave the link in the description box. And you can see it for yourself and see what you think. It's Dabu. Well, this one is Dabu777. Huge wheel-like object caught creeping by in space. Now you write that down if you can't see the description box. And you go take a look at this and let me know what you think. Okay, with that I'll say bye for now. Uh, I plead the blood of Jesus over this. And oh, in case you want to know, <laughs> I took this shirt. I was playing around with my new, uh, when I got my, they're like pens. Instead of squirting that paint on a shirt, they're like pens or something new. And I had this shirt, and the words were so faded, you you know, you could have to come up close to me to read. <laughs> so anyway, I scribbled them out. It kind of looks like Eastery, but I scribbled out the letters, and I wrote, Don't get left behind, so live right, repent. <laughs> Okay, so I, I haven't worn it much, but I thought, well, I'll wear it today. <laughs> it set, I mean, I don't know if you can read it all that well, but I just didn't want to waste the shirt, you know, because you couldn't see it, see the letters. They, they didn't print this one out very good when I got it. So anyway, um, I plead the blood of Jesus over this video, the internet connection, over myself, my inner my computer, and over all of you and your devices, your internet connections. And with that, I'll say bye for now. I'll talk to you later.